Interesting. Well, this one's from Alina Shapur. And we yeah. are live. Welcome to TNT Presents um, Outdoors Should I melt mine too? And my name is Kelly. I'm your one of your hosts. Uh, and Kevin will be in here a little bit. But we have um, Scott and his wife. Sam. Uh, or Sam, I mean Sam. I was gonna Good. Be talking to I'm out of Sam. here. Yeah. Sam and his wife are here, um, and they're going to be cooking up some good food. Uh, one of the dishes is Maryland cream of crab soup, so um, we will get with them in just a minute. So uh, appreciate Christy Brown being here, Catfish and Fresno, and Becky Redneck out there. Appreciate y'all being in here. I was cruising for fun anytime and NJ. So what's going on, Sam? Hey, we're doing all right. We're still opening a couple of things up. Um, I'm going to let my wife start first. Oh. Um, hers is the easiest, and it's actually we're giving you two soups. Yeah, um, one's going to be the vegetable, the vegetable crab, mm -hmm. and then I'm going to be making the cream, cream crab. And because hers is uh, so easy, um, I wish I could turn this up. But uh, because it's so easy, we're going to let her throw it away. Give you some ingredients. I think I've got Kelly, the, uh, if you're looking for the ingredients, I've got that in the description. And also I have it on a uh, picture that I can show off during the, during the live stream so that people can see what, what you're using. Yeah, that'd be cool. And uh, so as, what I'm doing with mine, I'm getting mine started. This is the cream of crab. I'm going to turn this down. All right. So what I got here, and the only thing you're really going to chop up is... The celery and onions, okay? Yeah. Celery and onions, the celery and onions. About okay, so the recipe is going to call for like one batch, okay? Because we have so much crab meat, um, I'm putting four pounds of mine. She's going to put three pounds in hers. And that's because on our channel, we do a lot of crabbing. And uh, we, whatever we get, we got left over, we pick, vacuum seal, and we put it in the freezer. So that's why we got some much. Um, gotcha. Right now, so everything, I'm gonna try to give you the recipe for one batch, okay? Even though I'm gonna be doubling it. Um, but what I'm gonna do now, I got one cup of butter, about a cup of, cup of celery and onions. Now that is only gonna be used for flavor. That will not be in a soup, okay? Now my wife is going to get started, which you can leave the butter in there now. Now hers is a veg vegetable, and it's so easy that you're basically just going to stick everything in a, in the pot. Mm -hmm. All right, we're going to let her do that. Yeah. The, but the, the, there is one other thing. In my cream of crab, I use Old Bay. Okay. In the we use Old Bay. Um, I'll put it up there. Yeah, I don't know where I'm here too. There, we we'll use Old Bay. There you Old go. Bay. Yep. Where's the J.O. box? Okay. Now, in her suit, we use J.O. It's a little... Um, this company here has been in Maryland for 76 years. So, everybody thinks only Mariners... Mar Marylanders. <laughs> <laughs> uh, just use Old Bay. Um J.O. is a huge spice here. Um, I'm just particular with Old Bay in mind. But whenever I steam crabs, it is always J.O. number two. A lot of people don't realize when you get Maryland steamed crabs and out anywhere or somebody yeah. steams it for you, it's J.O. number two, not Old Bay. Um, so she's going to go ahead. I'm going to open it up. I don't say Old Bay is more like a southern, southern thing anyways. No. Is it? I don't know. That's all I've known it down here. I, ever, yeah, ever since we grew up, that's what, what we had. I'm going to open these up. I'm going to let her, they'll see you on the camera there. Just start adding everything in. Just let them know what you're putting in. Okay. Like I said, he has a description. Yeah. This is yours, right? All right, I'm melting the butter. Well, the butter's not, you can just start adding everything. What? Well, no, I still yeah. want to melt. Oh, cabbage. Oh, shit. <laughs> there is one other <laughs> thing you got to cut up. Yeah, that's what I'll say. You got a you got uh, half head of cabbage. It's, hold up. <laughs> Where is it outside? It might be. 
See, live streams. He forgot the cabbage. <laughs> now, in yours, yours, you are going to leave everything in it, right? Are you? You're not. No. Leave, you're not taking stuff out for taste, right? No. What? Um, in mine, I in got the, the onions in the, in the, in the uh, vegetable crab soup. The, yeah. The, no, the cabbage is staying in. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So you can start adding everything. Okay. Backlash, what's going on? Tina Ladybug. Appreciate you all coming here. Make sure you hit that thumbs up, share it out. And we're not professional. No. <laughs> it's two neither cans of. Yeah, neither are we. That's the reason, reason why we have this done. Whoop. And strong. <laughs> hey, guys. Hey. <laughs> all right. So, yeah, in, in this vegetable crab, you're going to get a half a head. Of cabbage, yep. mm -hmm. you're going to chop it up. Next, we add a container of chicken broth, which is 32 ounces. Uh, Joe, the... This is Sam and his wife from Outdoors in Maryland. Who's doing the cooking? Yeah, we just got we get so much crab meat stuff from crabbing. So I don't want to block this. So I'm just doing it long strips and then I'll do it. Cause I'm going to make it in like little I'm tiny bite size. That. Yeah. Now everybody's recipe is different. Somebody might be seeing this going like, what the hell? Handle on the beans. So you'll notice I talk a lot. <laughs> Can of Southwest corn with peppers. <laughs> What's up, Dre Lasha? Might overload. Appreciate it. Appreciate you coming over here, hanging out. And I'm gonna pop up the um, ingredients real quick. So if you all want to, a can of diced tomatoes, but I like yeah. this one here. Oh, the Rotel. Rotel. Oh, yes, yeah, Rotel. And it's a little bit more spice. I'm gonna pop up the ingredients so everybody can like, take know. a picture of it or however you want to do it, real quick. Where's the other rod? So there's there there's is. that. Oh. And then I also zoom use in a little bit. Hand. So in one pot, uh, Sam's doing, he's doing the Maryland cream of crab soup. And then his wife is doing the vegetable right. crab soup. So here's the two different and lists then, of ingredients on the screen for me. V8 juice, which is spicy. Mm -hmm. All right, so now. I like spice. I'm going to be adding. It smells good. Uh, to our screen. There you go. 32 ounces of two cups, right? Yep. I didn't know that. No, no, no. That's going to be more. That's going to be more V8 juice ounces. than I've never drunk in my life. So what's, that, <laughs> what's, that, what's that four cup? Yes. Four cups. Oh, shit. Okay. All right. So, like I said before, I'm doubling. Me, I'm doubling. But yeah, in the doubling, natural yeah. one, you're going to only have two cups. So, I'm going to add all the liquids. Certified fishing nut. What's going on? So that is half from half. In the in ingredients, you'll see I put two cups of milk, two yes. cups of oh, heavy, whipping heavy cream. cream. Yeah. So now I don't think I need the milk because now I got four cups. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> uh, I think this is one of those recipes again that I, I kind of can smell it. Well, I feel Ooh. like I'm chicken broth. It's it's 30, it should be 32 it's, ounces, and that's four cups. Four cups. See? There's M&T. Very smart. Living and cooking. Appreciate you coming in here. What's going on? Yeah, I, I concur with m and I'd like to have a bowl of that right now. I really don't think uh -huh. have a... What's that? Enough. That's going to be too small. Think so? I'm not done yet. Yeah, I got crab meat. I got this, that. Cabbage. Cabbage. Oh, my goodness. Oh, poor... They're saying all oh, poor you. you. <laughs> I love <that. laughs> all right. Um, so good. I don't know. Just add it in. Now, what, temp, really, now what temp did you all have with that? When you, when you... Well, she's got this. We had this kind of like on, on medium. Me, I turned it up a little bit to get the melt, butter melted. Yeah. And. But you're you're like trying to, you're trying to cook in the flavor into the water and stuff. Okay, so I'm gonna also add the J.O. spice. 
yeah, and so seasoning she, packet. So she's adding the J.O. box. Mm -hmm. The J.O. box uh, soup seasoning, okay. And here's the seasoning yeah. also. Gotcha. Girl, Ashley says she's got her bowl ready. Yeah. yeah. I'll tell you. Now, see, ours is going to be because we put the V8 hot. It's a, it's a V8 spicy. Gotcha. And somebody goes, what are you putting V8 in there? But trust me. It works. That's good. <laughs> now, this is not going to be hot. Like, you can't tr eat it or we wouldn't do it. Yeah. Uh, yeah. But it's, but it's going to give you a little bit of spice. Yeah. Um, because once you, once you yeah. cook it down, the, the, the hotness is we going like to, to add away extra once you add everything into it. So. Extra what? Extra, extra spice. Chill. So we add yeah. hot sauce. Avid. Stuff. What's going on? Yeah, we'll be putting in some hot sauce. Like I said, make sure you hit that <laughs> thumbs up and share it out, guys. <sighs> We're not if putting it up outdoors in Maryland, make sure you do. Uh, they're an cabbage. awesome channel. They go crabbing and they do a lot of this stuff on their channel. Fishing. Oh my. I'm getting ready for the first time in two weeks to go offshore. I've never been offshore. Mm -hmm. I think the video will probably just me being sick throwing up all yeah. the time. Oh, yeah. <laughs> About two days He's prior to it, take right? it from Yeah. Yeah. Somebody said take it. Like the night before? Like two days. Or it yeah. might be a day before, yeah. The day before or the night or the two and nights the before. Yeah. Is let's just get warm. Get this to um let me go it. Simmer now, down. Now see now basically that's done. No, we still no. have to add the crab meat and this all has to get um, you know, um what's what? the word I'm looking for? Yeah. It all has to go down. It just seems like I need more liquid cooked, in there. Yeah, it all has to be cooked down, yeah. You, you no, you got another thing of it, right? <laughs> Yeah, but it's only four cooks. Do you have to have water to yours? No, no okay. water. I ain't putting no damn water. <laughs> Water's bad. <laughs> Water's other, not your friend. <laughs> now, the other thing that I'm going to change, um, to thicken it up, I usually put one cup of water, one cup of flour. Mm -hmm. And what you have to do is cook out the flour taste, you know? Um, so if you want to check out a, a cooking another cooking channel um it's where i he went and did my recipe cream of crab recipe yeah um, that is russ jones from smoky ribs barbecue and uh he used this it's called Mondra. Mondra. it looks very old like old time stuff oh yeah but what you can do with this is that you can just add it as you need it and when you get it to your thickness you can just stop it it's kind of like Where, what we use. It's kind of like what we use in the hospital setting. It's a thickener, what we call a thickener, yeah. which is to make your liquids a lot thicker. But and the good, the thing is, is that when you put the one cup of water, one cup of flour, sometimes every time it's a little bit different. Yes. As it goes in, where this I can add as, as I go and keep stirring it until I like the thickness, and yeah. then I, I don't have to cook the flour taste out. Gotcha. I'm hearing my voice. And my ear is driving me nuts. <laughs> it's driving me nuts. Once this all simmers down, we add the three pounds of crab meat that I like to use. Yeah. The more, the better. Damn right. <laughs> Damn right. And Old Bay. And Old Bay. No, 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 you, no, 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 I use both. No, we. Oh, we're using that kind. Yeah. So. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> when we now, this is Jo number one. This is all purpose. Seafood seasoning, shrimp, steamed shrimp. I don't know, you guys down in the south clean out your damn crabs. What's wrong with you? <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> <laughs> we Creo steam needs to be in here. Creo needs to be everything. in here telling him that. That's weird. Steamer fry. You just say we're sitting there, guy pulling a shell, cleaning all the inside out. We're like, no. Yeah, no. <laughs> That's where the good stuff's at. Yeah, it's poopy. Oh. It's, it's, it's a flavor. Yeah, it's a good poopy flavor. The best poop ever. Huh? Flavor saver. So you all don't. You actually all don't it. irrigate the crabs or. Okay, so add some of this. Like they do. Jo number one. What's that there? So you don't actually one. irrigate all the crabs like they do down south. Like they run it through to water taste. and filtrate it through no. to clean them. No. Yeah. I mean, we take the. Oh. No, we take the dead <laughs> man, man fingers off. Oh heck um, yeah. Stuff like that. But the but yellow the inside. Now. 
think about it. Who is everyone here to eat soft shells? Yeah, you eat the whole thing. You, know, you don't cl really clean it. And you inside. eat, yeah, you eat the whole thing. So even when you're doing a crab, you take it off. There's a, sometimes there's a lot of stuff up in the shell. Mm -hmm. All that is is a shell creating another shell before he's going to uh, molt, whatever I was going to do. Yeah, molten. All right, so on my end, I'm just cooking. I'm going to turn this up a little bit. And I got on a medium too. heat. What's up, Shannon? Now hers. And Mine's I'm just, all about simmering and letting the flavors blend. Yeah. Gotcha. So right now, you see this thing right here? This is an off ice maker. Sorry. <laughs> You're funny. <laughs> now, it calls for one stick of cream cheese. I'm adding two Doubling. because I doubled. It just don't look like a lot. It doesn't. What's going on? So it was two, Kevin two, K. Four cups. It was two cups milk, two cups of heavy cream. Mm -hmm. Right. Milk, you said, right? And we and we had that. You didn't do the this heavy is, cream yet. No, that's it. Half and half. Okay. We'll get a little view well, of what, what, what their kitchen that? looks like. Here's 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 our here's kitchen another view. chicken broth. You gotta add. No, it's only four cups. I would add four. it. So, that's so, why I got those. Yeah. Yeah, because it's only, for me. I'm doing two cups of each of the of the fluids. Um, but I got four cup and I could put 32 ounces. That's four cups, right? Yeah. Okay. I guess everybody knows. I don't know. We'll check on <laughs> to check you guys. I told you a cup is eight ounces. Okay. All right. I'll trust you. She's, she's correct. Right she had to ask twice. <laughs> <laughs> um, just don't look like a, mine don't look like a lot of soup. No, but, but mine I, is. <laughs> yeah, that's gonna last a while. Oh yeah. But we usually give it out. You know, friends. If anybody lives close. Yeah. You guys are all like Tennessee or something, you, Kentucky. Kentucky yeah, or Georgia. 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 So now hers. It's just letting her. Um, I need a knife, though. Here, let me get. It. Let me walk back and forth. What that? The best that we created. Yeah. So you don't need the milk. I don't. I don't think so. Sherry, um, you need sherry. Well, I'm gonna. I'm gonna put a couple. Yeah, we already sherry. sherry. Okay. Yeah. Have and don't forget about the rest of the chicken broth. You might as well use it. Well, I'm not. Yeah, I'm not putting it in. I'm going by the recipe. So I put. Mm. It's two cups of broth. Two cups of uh, heavy cream. Two cups of milk. All right, so that's half, half, half and half. Yep. Just don't look like a lot. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to just chunk. You done? You already done the salt and pepper, right? Or that's later? No. Okay. Listen to you talking me out. <laughs> I, I'm just looking at your recipe. No, you're right. I'm, I'm just, just looking kidding. at your recipe, just making sure because you I named forgot. almost everything on there except for. I mean, you just named the sherry, and I'm just like, okay, what else? That has he not said anything about salt and pepper? Yeah, salt and pepper. Usually when I first put everything in or put the celery and onions in that's when yep. i usually add salt and pepper gotcha yeah but we just had a little difficulty starting couldn't hear you so i'm chunking i'm chunking these up so it'll be easier to melt gotcha. i usually have an emergency immersion blender once i get it in so we're just going to let the celery and the onions cook and I'll take a question. Hey, if anybody has any questions or something. Oh. Why don't you put the crab meat in? Oh, I was going to wait till it, the, the cabbage up. simmered down, and then I was going to put the crab meat in. Okay. That's how I usually roll. That's how you roll. <laughs> I roll. I'm going to get another. Give me this cup here. This bowl, I mean. This one. So uh, once it's kind of cooks, I might actually turn this up a little bit. Yeah. I want this to cook a, boil a little bit. Get it really. We want to get it hot. We don't want to scold it. We don't want the milk or anything to scold. Um, and then I'm just going to take this, scoop out the onions and lettuce. And then we'll put the cream cheese, sherry, and we'll let it cook a little bit. And then we'll add the thickener. It's pretty simple. And it turns Reason. out awesome. Marvelous. Yeah, I mean it's a, it's a pretty simple, pretty simple little uh, recipe. 
And I'll show it again here real quick and <clears throat> let people can see. So here's here's the recipe again. Yeah, I'm gonna turn this up a little bit. Here, but we open it up. As natural spirits it says. So that way you all can see what they're what they're using um, for each one. Like I said, uh, over here is what Sam is putting in his. Uh, right now he's just got, like he said, he's got the onions and the celery in it, um, which is the Maryland cream of crab soup. And then his wife is doing the vegetable crab soup. And you have most, which ninety percent of all her ninety five percent of all her stuff is already in there except for the crab meat. Yeah, that's simple, and it's so good. You know, when it's yeah. usually we make this stuff during the winter time. Um, that way we have it. We want to pull out a bowl of soup or anything like that. Um, but we already got through hers, and I haven't made mine. But I got one cup of sherry. That's going to go in. And now we're just waiting for this to get out. So you've got one cup of sherry for the for the mix and then one cup of sherry for yourself? No. <laughs> well, since since you're since you're you're waiting on that, once you give it, once you uh, let them know a little bit about who you are and your channel and stuff. Um, I started a channel about three years ago. Um, I'm an older guy, obviously, and my friend always says, "Ah, that's for younger. That's for the younger kids." And I know Russ is sixty in the sixties, and he's got three hundred or two hundred sixty some subs. I started it. Um, crabbing, uh, we did uh, working on my boat, but basically it's an outdoor channel. I do do a little hunting. Um, I haven't posted it here because everybody gets butt hurt. Yeah. Um, because if you want to show field dress in a door, I mean a deer, um, something like that, where they get uh, you get strikes and put down and all that stuff. So. Most of the time, me and the wife, all summer long, uh, we do some crabbing. We do recreational crabbing. And I usually, I just went out with my next door neighbor. She's a commercial waterman, water woman. Um, she oystered all year. I got a video of that. If you want to check it out, we were out oystering with her commercially. And uh, she does crabbing. And I get a chance whenever I want to go, I could go with her and film her. Um, but we're, the wife's going to do some more fishing with me. I'm sorry to echo in my ear. You know, I'm talking. Um, but she's going to do some more fishing with me. Um, I just put a video up about a, two hours ago. Um, one of the things, um, I had to fix uh, my trolling motor, and I did that success successfully. Yes. See, I've been off for about two months, going on three months mm -hmm. from work. Um, I own a small bread business. I'm a bread man. Yep. When you go into Walmart, see all the great value stuff. I take that to the stores. Um, but I had knee surgery. I don't know if you want to see it. See, nice big, <laughs> yeah. big giant scar. Had a total knee replacement. And um, but I'm ready to get back to work. No. no. <laughs> I gotta say, I know you ain't. That's a lie. <laughs> trying to get back because I used to work in the bread business. No. No, I know you're not ready to get back into it. Is it boiling? No. Yeah, it's getting hot. See, now it's hot. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take all the celery. Yeah. Onions Drain out. that. That's the good part. Yeah, we've been trying to do something different with our dogs and not give them as much of the other stuff. So i got like pumpkin, blueberries. Yogurt, applesauce, blueberries, fruit, all kind of fruit. If you guys got Pumpkin. dogs, you want to know if you want to give them treats and instead of giving them uh, the shit from the store, excuse my language, I'm sorry, um, go buy a bag of broccoli. frozen broccoli and they yeah. love it. Yes. You want to give them a treat or go bring you back some carrots. I was say carrots has always been a good idea. Well, if they're puppies... And they're they're not they're uh, teething. What you could do is shave them off, cut the end, and put them in the freezer. Mm -hmm. Put them in the freezer, and then they'll gnaw on them, take them a little bit longer, eat. 
All right, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to add the cream cheese. Philadelphia yep. cream cheese. Wife does not like anything. No, no cream. cream cheese. No creamy. I don't no like I don't like cream of crab or nothing like that. Blah blah blah. Nothing blah. creamy. Huh. Nothing. So that's why you make Eat. two different soups then. Yeah. Well, I mean I like the other one, but she won't she won't need to do. No. No fish? No not. No fish. Nope. No deer. Nope. Nothing. Very picky. I like my wife. <laughs> so silly. No you know how silly it is? Um, <laughs> you can go and you get like um, a sauce or something, and she finds out like like mac and cheese. <laughs> a lot of times I'll use like sour cream I have to, to actually make it creamy. Right. She'll eat it, loves it. As <laughs> soon as she finds a sour cream in it, won't eat it. Nope. <laughs> cream cheese, sour cream, nope. Mayonnaise, nope. She loves my wife it. Said, no my wife just said, yep, that would be me. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> All it's right, so usually what I'll do it's about 351. is get the the most fire. Um, but this might take a little bit, yeah. as long as you guys ain't in a rush. Or not. No, we nope, we're good. I'm just going to use my little whisk and uh, just whisk it around. To kind of break up all the yeah. cream cheese this is nice and hot uh we don't want to like i said we don't want to scold it man this looks good nope <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, take you a big spoonful of it i like butter looks good now i'm going to add the sherry one sherry. cup or it's a half a cup it's a half cup but i'm using a full cup i don't think you yep. could drink that and i'm gonna yeah. i don't know want to try it no what's worse than this just won't like it. <laughs> now, obey. Obey the text. Um, I have the obey now, shirt. <laughs> so what you? So for us, we have to watch when we make soups, crab cakes, anything that we use our crab meat, because we steam our crabs with Jo season. Mm -hmm. um, it's very salty. So you got to watch. You guys, if you're most likely going to buy plain crab meat. With no seasoning to it, right? Yeah, we have ours is seasoned. Yeah, ours has got. You I know, make sure I put seasoned. the yellow mustard and everything through our crab meat. Yeah, all the poopy stuff. Yeah. So, coast and the seasoning up, snuggers that we would put tons of seasoning on the jo yeah. number two. <laughs> yeah. So I'm mustard with crab. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I heard that. <laughs> <laughs> Uh oh, we got four. Uh, your iPad went to sleep. All right, so now I got the. There we go. Right now. Obey in there. And like I said, I'll probably give it a little taste. Any salt and pepper? I no, I already had the salt. Okay. You don't need that much. The obey is on. <laughs> Appreciate Are you guys being right? here and hanging out. Make sure y'all hit that thumbs up. Like I said, share people? it out. How many people we got in? Oh, uh, we got twelve right now. That's cool. Yep. I uh, put it on mine too to see if anybody wants to come in. All right, so there's the old day. Now I'm gonna get ready to add. Oh, sorry, Snuxer. Wandra. Wandra. Mm -hmm. And we'll do the same thing. I'll add some Wandra, and I'll just I keep starting it. Mud tree. So so what is the wander exactly? Is flour mixed it's with a I would think it's just like a thickener. Just uh oh. Froze again. Sam, I don't know if you can hear me, but we lost you. On audio. Because he used mustard in his crab meat. <laughs> 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 Might have to unmute the other one. I can't. They muted it. Oh, I see. How's that? Yeah, I can hear you. Yeah. Okay. We don't put mustard in it. What we put 
is whenever you clean a crab after we steam yeah. them, there's this really bright yellow good stuff right in the middle. Mm -hmm. That's what we stick in there. And we call it mustard. Yeah. You guys call it disgusting. Well, not everybody does. <laughs> yeah. What, mustard? I didn't think I'd like it either. No, but... no. Inside a crab. Yeah. Oh. The mustard <laughs> filling. Oh, yeah, the yeah. mustard filling of a crab. You mix it with, yeah. uh, with the um, seasoning oh, to die for. All right, so, so now what I'm going to do, I'm going to start adding the wandra to thicken it up and just add a little bit at a time. I like... Oh, lost him again. Yeah, we lost you again on audio. It's his iPad, what it is. Yeah. Sam, can you hear me? We lost your audio again. Mm, froze up too. No. Is that coming in yet? Yep. Yeah. Now you are. Yep. It's a Wi Fi. <laughs> and we're right next to the to the thing. What thing? The Wi-Fi thing. All right. So what I'm going to do is we're going to switch. Okay. I'll right. move. You move. Yep. Fly. Don't oh, lift it. Just slide it. <laughs> he moved quick. She didn't move so quick. <laughs> All right. So saying? we'll turn. You got it on high. Well, well yeah. Move. Because um, I'm trying to render the cabbage down. Oh, yeah. You got this. You got this hot. Ooh, hot, hot. Oh, yeah. Let me turn this down. I have mine. All right, I'm going to take this off. Yeah, let, let it go down. down a little bit. I'm going to turn that off because that's really boiling, and we don't want that boiling. 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 <laughs> boiling. All right, so I'm going to add a little bit more wandering. Yeah. And, and then we're just going to add it on. In. That's a thickener that he's using to thicken the, uh, the soup part of it. You hear them dogs? They're going nuts out there. Yeah, they're great. I don't know what to do with them. I've only taken it off because it's really hot. Yeah. Um, the the heat. It's been a while since you've made this. Yeah. Well, I like the wand. Both of wander. us actually. I like the wander. Oh yeah, it's been thickening pretty good. Yeah. What you want? Yeah, what I like it. Kevin? Okay. I like it pretty thick. Not like. I do like a thing. It's supposed to the, the spoon is supposed to stand up in it. Oh, really? Just with, maybe not too much. Yeah. That'd be thick. Just remember that's on. Yeah. Yeah, that's on. I'm going to turn that off. Okay. Right it's okay. your mind on medium. It has to go off a little. You can kind of see me, right? Yep. We can see you through both of them. Sorry, you guys can't, can't taste it. We can. <laughs> we, we, we have taste of vision. I hope, I, I hope the live stream's a little bit better than I thought. It's going good. Still. You know it's you know it's going well whenever I shut my mouth. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Because when, when, Kevin will talk talk your ear off, but if he's quiet, it means he's liking it because he's really concentrating on exactly what you're doing. <laughs> yeah. What's oh, really good? Huh? It's thickening. Yeah, it's really thickening. I like it. I want to say that I listen to them that I absolutely love the new logo, by the way. It absolutely. Oh, yeah, I didn't even notice you that. Guys. For us? No, for uh, right. our friends at uh, Outdoor Wicked Adventures. Oh. Yes. She uh, oh, they... yeah, did the uh, paddlefish a couple weeks ago. Yeah, they. Uh, Finally hit their 1K and uh, unveiled their new logo. Uh, what uh, yesterday? I think it was. Yeah. And it really looks good. Yeah. I got. Um, I have a real lofty goal this summer, and that's to hit 10,000 subs. So we'll see how that works. Along with <laughs> a lot of crabs. Yeah. Well, <laughs> I'll probably. I do. Might have a collab. I'm going to be catching a snakehead. Here we have 
the northern snakehead to mm -hmm. catch. Very delicious to eat. And uh, I'm going to send one down to Russ for um, Smoky Ribs, Smoky Ribs Barbecue. All right. I think this is just about thick enough. Okay. We're going to just let it. What do you do next? Let it simmer down? Or? I'm going to get ready to put the crab in. Okay. Well, I think I'm going to put like, get ready to do that. This is simmering down also. Yeah. So. Yeah. You want the cabbage real nice yeah. and soft. Yes. Joe said he's waiting on playoff hockey to, to come on. Up. <laughs> yeah. I'm a, I'm a Capitals. I'm a Capitals fan. I'm an Oils fan. I had my Oils shirt on earlier. Mm -hmm. oh, they're doing pretty good. Young team. I haven't watched too much sports, really. After all the hoopla. hoopla. Oh, yeah. Just kinda... <laughs> well, it's getting, it's getting getting worse now because they just posted a picture on for the NBA. I was disgusted. What? Is my, is my kneeling? Mm-mm. Worse. Clean. Worse? Worse. Uh, all right. I guess we'll both add right. our crab meat. That so Joe said, go hurricanes. I'm adding three pounds. I'm adding four pounds. Right. Four pounds of crab meat. Ooh, crab meat. I'll now, these crab, crab meats. I'll just add so the crab meat. Well, the crab meat, what you got to do once we freeze it, if you kind of see yeah. in the bag, it's a little freeze wet. Freeze and seal bags. So, what we normally would do is take it out, kind of dry it off. And I'll let it just let it sit out a little bit. Um, for us, we got to kind of go through it, make sure there's no shells in it. Yeah, I'll, that's my that's my job. Yeah. <laughs> I do it all. Yeah, she picks it. She does everything. Pick it, clean it, freeze it. Do you, you see that comment there, Kevin? And forget uh, it. And then we make crab <clears throat> balls, crab soup, crab cakes, everything. We've actually got a couple appetizers. Yeah. On the channel. Yeah. Um, some crab appetizers. You want to check it out. Like this, the base here, you want to do an oyster stew or shrimp yeah. or mm -hmm. you can do anything with this. Yep. The base of it, you can add anything. Yeah. See, See I would be out. I would be cooking all that it up. Could be. And then I would have to I, I would have to freeze it been 95 of, percent of it <laughs> if I'd be the only one to eat it. And that's what they're gonna be doing. What's that? They say they're gonna they're gonna they're gonna freeze it up and then yeah. We make making, all this. We're making seven pounds of crab meat is what's going on. I got four. All together. She's got three. I have three. Yeah, she's got three, three in hers, and he's got four. And I'd we still to, got nine and a half pounds left in the freezer. Well, I, I'd have to hide the, the crab meat because I'd Ready never to get go. to use it if I didn't. Because there's certain someone who's over <laughs> that way who would eat it all up before I could get to it. Add some more hot sauce. <laughs> Now she don't have an ear piece in, no, so she don't know. Yeah, I can hear anything. So that's, but there's four pound crab meat. Hello, Miss Ashley Brady. Hello, Miss Ashley. <laughs> they say jealous. Yeah, you know, see how <laughs> you can see that how it kind of looks nice and thick. Ooh, yeah. oyster stew too. Ooh. Yeah, oysters, shrimp, crawl, I'd have, crawfish. Crawl I'd have better luck with the oyster stew because I know under that certain someone wouldn't touch the oysters. Yeah, <laughs> she kind of has, right. <clears throat> has the same. She has the same condition that your wife does. Uh, oh, it, nice. it, it has to taste or, or has a certain a certain feel to it. You know, yeah, she doesn't she doesn't bother it. Nope. All right, so I'm gonna try it. For taste. Go ahead. <laughs> okay. Uh, guys, I don't know what you're missing. Oh, so sorry. But I'm going to add a little bit more. Okay. Oh, I've lost had, sound again. It lost sound again, Sam. Uh, it's just the Wi Fi. There you go. There you go. There we go. Get back in. The Wi Fi keeps go going in and out. Yeah. I don't know why. It's like your yeah, picture. Your picture, huh? your, your picture of the food is like perfect. It's, everything's perfect. It's like your your others goes off every so often. 
Yeah, the phone does. Oh, fine. the phone. Yeah, phone does fine. It's just the iPad only. Yes, yeah, iPad. I love doing my live streams on the iPad because um, I can set it up. But I'm going to start using my computer for that. I think that's been be more solid. Or another. Well, I or can tell you. Phone, or you can just do another phone too. Yeah, I mean, I got a brand new iPad upstairs, and it did the same thing. Well, both of these suits are <clears throat> basically done. Pretty much done. You can see how mine's a little nice and thick. And mine is vegetably. <laughs> yeah, vegetably. Yeah, that's a new one. With a ton of crab meat. Three pounds. So that's basically it. I mean, I could yep. let this. I don't think I really need to cook it anymore. Well, I'm going to let mine simmer. Yeah, you the cabbage. See, hers, I think the more you simmer it, the better it's going to get. Yes. Yeah, because you're, you're going to cook down that, that cabbage, yeah. Yeah. Mine, taking off the heat, yeah. I think that's good and done. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, it'll thicken uh, up, too, when you, once you take it yeah. off the heat, right? Yeah, yeah, that'll thicken up. And what usually what will happen is I might have to, when I pull it out, um, it's really, really thick. I might have to add, like, a little bit of milk yeah. just to yeah. kind of loosen it up a little bit. And that's kind of yeah. how I like it. It's very thick. I don't want it soupy, right? Like hers. Well, that's because I, I eat that broth. A good bite, yeah. And, I want a good um, bite. Yeah. Tomato stuff, piece. Yeah. Look out! Look how nice that is. Oh, oh yeah. I I got my bowl. Tons ready. of meat. I got my bowl ready. Yeah, that's. Yeah, we uh, we're lucky, you know, blue crab here in Maryland. You know, we we're pretty lucky, and she's crazy. If I say, look, we're going to go do some fishing. Uh, we need to get up and leave by 5 o'clock. Mm -hmm. She's like, no, no, no. You go. I don't need to go. If I said we're going <laughs> crabbing. We got up at 3. She was up at 3. <laughs> we had breakfast made. Coolers were filled. Um, dressed. Can, can I mean, you call my wife and, and, and <laughs> give her the hints of how you could do that? That's how I roll. <laughs> and how she rolls. Yeah, I mean, she... I'm talking lunch was packed. No. Uh oh, oh we lost you again. Yeah, it'll jump back on here in a minute. Oh, uh, oh there we go. Oh, you, oh, you got me back. Oh. Yeah. It's just if I freeze, I'll come back. <clears throat> yeah. But I'm pretty much done. Um, if you want me to, I'll eat the bowl later. But if you, you need, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead and do a taste Show test. That. Oh, it tastes. Let me tell you. Go ahead and y'all do a taste test and everything. You're That's supposed to put, I think, a little old bay on uh, top for seasoning. CFM I mean, Queen. She said this is super cool. It's like Iron Chef cookoff, but they're the, yeah. they're they're the they're the winners. Oh, the it's thick. That's thick. It'll get thicker. Oh yeah, that's real thick. That's real thick. That right here. Yeah. Yep, everybody's saying, help yourself, eat up. <laughs> oh, got to freeze up again. Yeah, they'll come back. That's delicious. You can hear me on a phone, right? Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's... that's. It ain't a whole lot, though. And I'm telling you, the, the, the cream cheese, really what make, makes it, you know, that the creaminess and everything, um, that, I think, is definitely the big... Uh, Sorry here. We're sorry we got two <laughs> puppies out there. They're, they're only like ten weeks old. Yeah. <laughs> um, so we got. So no, I'll play the story. Me. So we got the one. Are about echoing or can you hear me? But good. I right. muted your other one. Okay. The uh, I'll go ahead and mute this and turn the other one on. All right. No, I can't hear you now. On that, I can't hear you on that one. Okay. Sorry. Right. That one keeps going freezing. Yeah. The uh, sound quality is not bad though. No, that's fine. We got yeah, you're, you're, uh, so yeah, we, your sound quality is good on that one. That's fine. I'll just okay, it's muted. So we, when I lost my puppy, we had to put him down in September. Um, last September, he was only seven, going on eight. He had epilepsy, and we think yeah. that they were kind of pretty. They were pretty nasty. Um, just, just hard. They were hard to watch him go through the seizures. Yeah. Um, and something just happened where he kind of just 
kind of just, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. He just, it wasn't him. He wasn't barking, had no emotions, slept most of the day. And when he got up, yeah. um, he, all he would do was walk in a tight left circle. That's it. Oh. Tight left circle. It just got to the point that it just what we it was that was probably I put some dogs down and they all been tough but he was one of the toughest ones and I I said that's it no more dogs <laughs> once you go out there and say hi to your your pups <laughs> and and uh, so I said that's it we have a hundred and almost a hundred eighty pound Saint Bernard here too she's oh, wow. uh yeah she's uh she she has been when it comes to a good dog you couldn't ask for any better she was. I don't think she's hardly had any accidents crate training her. Um, we, when we crate trained her, whenever, I mean, she always went to her cage to go to bed. We never, we just never had any issues. She is, she was definitely the best. She was definitely the best. Yeah. Um, just, just, you know, training her and stuff. So all I kept seeing was puppy stuff on Instagram and stuff and puppy this and puppy that and dogs this and dogs that and, I finally gave in and I got, we went to get um, the puppy. She has a little issue, a uh, little issue with her, but she should be good. The doctor said the, uh, so the lady that we were getting it from called us up and said, Hey, you know, one of the people backed out on star. We called it, you know, we named her our the one that we picked out summer and somebody names star the other one. And we were like, no, 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 we, we picked summer. We want her. Me, I didn't say bring them in. That could be a nightmare. <laughs> oh. So I said, well, if she gives us a deal, we'll take them both. I know you hear the banging. That's them. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, Kevin? Huh? Hello, cats. Yeah, Welcome you're somewhere. Just turn off. Here, one, take it off. People in here, make sure y'all hit that thumbs up, share it out. Just, yet, hit, yet, you pick them out doors in Maryland? Uh, please do. Uh, Avid has been dropping their links. Uh, they're an awesome channel, awesome couple. Uh, All right, I'm gonna try to turn us around and things like that, so, so you can see the nightmares. You can see the nightmares. Yeah. Oh, cookie! Oh. Dog, 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 dog. And then go get our <laughs> spray Daisy. And then we got the big boy. Oh yeah, there's a big boy. Her big girl. Big, big girl. girl. Yeah. She's sweet baby. Oh. Thank God we got a bissel. <laughs> <laughs> right, <laughs> because the worst part is, at least if you you know somebody's having an accident, you know which one it is. But it seems like <laughs> some culprit has an accident. We don't know which one it is, so you can't like discipline them. Yeah, you know. <laughs> and I've been doing it. The, I've been doing it the new school way and Captain Old School, as I said. My wife gets sick of me here. Captain Old School is ready to you know stick you know kind of put their nose in it, kind of give them a little whack, you know, slap them on a butt and take them outside. Yeah, but I've held myself back. <laughs> I found myself back. But, um, Ever both said you got a are... bull moose. Yeah. <laughs> well, I wouldn't have. How did it get in? All right. They should be all right. The, uh, so they're both pretty much done. Like I said, she's going to let this simmer and let everything cook down. Um, it's kind of like when we do our spaghetti sauce, whether it be the meat sauce or the marinara sauce, it, it simmers for like six hours. That's just the Italian mm -hmm. stuff, I guess. But that's her mom. Her mom will not eat it unless it's been unless it's been simmering for six hours. For some reason, six hours is going to make it better. <laughs> but other than that, the soups are done. I hope everybody liked it. I hope everybody likes it. They're really actually pretty easy. There isn't a lot of chopping. There isn't a lot of um, in both recipes really, except for cutting up the celery and onions for me, and just cutting up a half cat's uh, half thing of a uh, head of lettuce. Really, uh, there isn't a lot of chopping or anything, mm -hmm. and it, ingredients or anything you get. You can get the fresh ingredients. We're just as good for the vegetable crab. And me, it's fine. You know, there ain't hardly any ingredients in it except for some liquids, basically. You guys there? Yep. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm just savoring yep. the taste. <laughs> he's, he's over there licking his lips and smacking his gums, trying to eat through, the TV, try to eat through the screen. I mean, I've already uh -huh. had to clean my screen once, you know. What's that? <laughs> he's, he's looking through the screen. She came through. <laughs> yeah, and you would think you would think we're starving these dogs because they look anorexic, but we feed them. I, I mean, we feed them. I, mean, I can't believe we feed them, but we're doing stuff like yogurt. We got the yogurt in there, and um, yogurt and blueberries and uh, 
peanut butter. Yeah, you're cleaning up like that. Else. <laughs> yeah. But other than that, if anybody's got any questions or you guys got any questions about anything, I don't care. I'll, I'll answer them. I think these are, like I said, I think this these are pretty much done. Um, we'll just... All right. I mean, if anybody's got any questions out in the chat um, for them, for their channel. Yeah. So I don't have a question, but <clears throat> I do have a statement. So um, my address is, um, <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> I mean, UPS is a wonderful thing overnight. Um, it'll still be fresh when it gets here. Yeah. I got to turn this on. Especially if he vacuum seals it up. Yeah. Yeah, buddy. So I didn't even so I didn't even turn on my, my light. I had my light down here, my fancy light. Oh, it's I bought and I didn't even turn it on. It was fine. Oh, it was actually fine. Yeah. Uh Avid <laughs> Avid does say that his bowl is empty if you can help him with that. I could Avid, Avid better get to it before I do. Yeah. yeah, <laughs> yeah. Well, I gotta tell you, it's good. I've never had anybody complain. Like I said, I think in the cream of crab, the, the cream of crab, I believe the cream cheese obviously is what makes it nice and creamy. And, and tastes as, as good as it does um, in the vegetable crab. Um, we couldn't find it. We finally found it the other day, but we think putting the um, the V8 spicy in it, um, I think that makes it better. Really? Yeah, I think that's that's a really good one I like. And the butter. You got to make sure you add the butter. Could you do me a favor and, <laughs> and grab these puppies? I was just about to highlight that. <laughs> Kevin says, Evan, look in your beard. I'm sure there's some crumbs in there or some crab meat left over. <laughs> Okay. okay, I'm gonna take my dogs here. But if there's any questions, man, come on, guys. Come on. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Ashley Brady says you should try crab pizza. Yes, so ma'am. They, they probably had have. They probably had it. Before. Crab pizza. Crab pizza. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna turn. I don't know if my mic's working over there. You have frozen again on the other one. Um, I'll actually just hold on one second. But other than that, man, that, that's it. They're actually pretty simple recipes. Um, it, I think sometimes people think it's a little bit harder than what it is, but it's not. Uh, they're, they're pretty easy, <laughs> and they taste great. <laughs> Kevin, it's Check not a boy, rainbow. Yeah, a rainbow microphone. Look at that. It's not a rainbow microphone. It just changes colors. I can't, I can't say much. I got a rocket ship. <laughs> Yes, he does. He yeah. has a rocket ship that changes color. <laughs> <laughs> How long we've we been on? Queen says we've been she on? loves your shirt. Yep, Iron Maiden, baby. I was debating whether to put the Iron Maiden on there, or you know, I got I'm a I'm a metalhead by, I'm a, definitely a metalhead, old school metalhead. Tell tell us about uh, your. I know you have another channel. Yeah, I'm I'm actually just posted one the other day. Um, we did the last video we did. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't put it in for about a year, um, but I actually uh, did one. We posted it, me and my buddy Tommy. He is from um, Amped Up Outdoors. Uh, we're, we're, we're definitely um, old school metalheads. And we did the top 13 metal bands that did covers. Um, like I had like Motley Crue doing Smoking in the Boys Room from, from like Guar, the band Guar that wears all the stuff doing yeah. Oh, yeah. Kansas City's way, uh, Wayward Son. That's that's oh. a that's a that's a hoot. But a lot of them were doing like Black Sabbath covers, and um, uh, I think what was some of my ones? I did uh, like Disturbed did the, the Sound of Silence. Um, that was I a pretty popular one. one. Yeah, yeah, that was a pretty popular one. And we couldn't double them up, you know. We, like I had Metallica, like Stone Cold Crazy, but they did like a lot of older stuff, you know, like um, Blitzkrieg and everything. Mm -hmm. Um. You know, then when you have the heavier bands, when you're talking about Hatebreed and Stephatora and stuff like that, doing covers of like Black Sabbath covers and everything. What did Blitz? What did Blitzkrieg that did a that did a, a whole song um, that was nothing? If you actually, if you actually translated it, it was actually a grocery list. Wasn't that Blitzkrieg that did that? I don't know. I would I would be lying if if I even told you I knew. I don't know that. I'm thinking. I don't know that. I'm Thinking that's who it was. I'd have to, but it was, uh, it was, it was one of their songs. I, th I think it was Blitz that did that. One of their songs, um, was, uh, 
literally, I mean, it sounded, you know, it sounded badass, you know what I'm saying? But it literally turns out that it was nothing more than a grocery shopping list. <laughs> and they were singing about a grocery I, shopping list. <laughs> I will, I will actually, ch- I, I will actually I check that I've out. I think I've heard that one. I think I've heard I that think- one. Somebody say something about that one before. I think it was them. I, I'd have to go back and research it and make sure, but I believe that's who it was that did that. It was it, it was one of those type bands, anyways, that did that, and I just thought it was just stupidly funny. Turn <laughs> that turn it might turn that mic down a little bit. I mean, if you're if you're done with that with that one, that one, go ahead. We can shut that one off. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna do that. There you, yeah, go. there you go. Yeah, we'll shut that one off. The um, but. I'm going to do another one. Um, one of my favorite bands of uh, one of my favorite bands of all time. Even though I only enjoyed their first two albums, that's um, that was a band called Metal Church. I don't know if anybody's ever heard of Metal Church. Um, they did a cover. See, that was my number one. They did a cover of Highway Star, which was really good. Um, but they got a new album coming out this in a couple weeks. I'm, I'm pretty excited about. It. I've heard two songs, and I'm getting ready to do a review on them to the two videos and two songs i'm working on it now see that one is see that kind of <laughs> that kind of channel is a lot easier i mean i gotta pull up like video i gotta pull up like pictures and videos and like bring all that kind of stuff in but when you when you're going to do a fishing or a crab in or stuff like that i mean you really you know you sometimes i've got like two or three cameras on the boat here i could pretty much just sit down at my desk and do everything and not really have to leave to do you know go out and make the video i can pretty much do everything right at what, what is your second channel's name so it's, called Headbang- it. it's called headbangers and hard rock television now i have one i was trying to combine the two channels together because a lot of the guys that i know that go outdoors and you know do the fishing and hunting and all that stuff they all love the music that i love listening to so mm-hmm. i figure that's the niche that's the that's the audience that i was looking for and the problem i was having is that i would all the bands, a lot of bands were from like Italy, Germany, Australia, a lot of metal bands um, mm-hmm. from old thrash metal to something like hair metal, 80s kind of. So it's a whole, I listen to everything. I'm not really into death metal stuff. The real, not really into that. Um, I, I, I don't mind the music so much, but the, the screaming, the, 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 the growling stuff. Um, there's a technique to it, so I'm not going to ever put any of them down because there's actually really techniques to actually be able to do that without, you know, losing your voice. Yeah. Um, but I'm, I got a couple videos, so I wanted to put them together. So when I was out fishing, I would bring a song to the guy that's with me or me by myself. And then what I would do is just kind of introduce the band, but play their music through the video, either while I'm fishing or anything so people can hear their music um, without, you know what I mean, without actually having to uh, build, but I kept getting copyrighted and I don't want to get copyrighted on my other channel. Yeah. Um, so that kind of made it hard. I don't mind getting copyrighted because I already got 73 subscribers on the other channel. It's called okay. Headbangers and Hard Rock Television. Um, but since I put that video up, you know, I might only get like 100 views or something like that. But this last video we did together, I mean, I got close to 1,000 views on that. You know, about a two week period that was very surprising um so i'm just going to keep you up i'm almost done the other one i'm going to make that video i'm trying not going to show this face that much on that video <laughs> <laughs> try, to, try to hide this mug a little bit um but i don't know i have fun with it now i'm not a guy that you know like my buddy tommy he can tell you albums and everybody that's in the band and has all the cds and stuff I kind of wasn't like that. I can't I can't remember all the songs and what albums they came from and um, like how many band members they switched and who switched. And uh, I mean, I kind of know know stuff, but when it comes into a lot of the detail stuff, I don't I don't know a lot of the detail stuff. But I like I like learning, I like listening to the guys that that actually know all the all the stuff, which I think is which is um, pretty exciting. That any kind of music. We listen to anything. We're from, we'll listen to Daryl Hall and John Oates all the way up to Slayer. Um, but yeah, if, if you yeah, listen to pretty much anything, if you are into like um, our favorite singer right now, he's kind of goes around a little bit. He's from you know. Dino from Croatia. 
Is that what it is? Croatia? Um, he's, he's a metal singer. So if anybody's heard of the Trans-Siberian Orchestra. Yes. Okay. So the yes. original band, the original band from them was a band called Sabotage back in the 80s. They were a heavy metal band. Mm -hmm. But they were always kind of theatrical with their music and their singing. I mean, it's, it's, it's heavy metal, but it's, um, they, were, they always have like the keyboards and stuff like that. And a long time ago, they, they formed this Trans-Siberian Orchestra. Well, Dino is actually one of the singers in the, on the tour when they go on tour. Um, his name is Dino Jalusic. Um, I don't even know how you got to find that. But if you go on my, maybe you go on my channel, maybe I'll put him up there. Um, but it's, he's, man, he was one of these. They like uh, Daryl and John. Yeah, Daryl and John. Yep. Love them guys. Oh, yeah. We are. What's up, Sean? Um, we also like Little River Band. Yeah, like Little River Band from Ambrosio. Yeah. Like that stuff. Oh, yeah. Mm. And then we like Slayer and Five Finger Death Punch. <laughs> Love me some Five Finger Death Punch. Uh, that's my wife's favorite band, man. She loves them guys. <laughs> they were on my. They were on there too. They did like Bad Company. They re did a cover of Bad Company. I didn't pick that one. Um, that back in the eighties. Back in the eighties, there was a band. Um, uh, what was his name? I forgot his name. The um, he did a song called Blue on Black. So yes. Five Finger Death Punch actually did that cover. Oh, they, and yes. that was that was on my list. That's a good good song. So here's here's I, song. I, post, I posted the link, but here's here's their here's his other channel. So you kind yeah, of have so an idea what it looks the like. other ones with the Snakehead. Me and him went out and did some Snakehead. I so they were pretty bad. I mean, I was kind of learning how to do that kind of stuff. Um, Which one learning about? how I wanted to do this. What my whole thing was me bringing some music to my friends that are all. That's all we do when we're together is talk music. We talk. I mean, everything, but most of it's heavy metal. So I thought, all right, well, how about I send you guys a song and then you come on video and tell me what you think of it. And that's kind of the beginning of what we wanted. I wanted to do. Mm. But then it's when you try to get other people the video and bring it to you and send it to you, that kind of can become a hassle. So, yeah. Um, so I'm just going to do it myself. I think I got a good way. I'm, we're going to um, do this. I'm just going to talk about the band. I'm actually going to script what I'm saying. You know what I mean? So I don't, because a lot of times I'm off the top of my head. I just, I go off the top of my head. I, I, I might do a couple takes, but I, I'm not a very organized person. So I believe it was, uh, I, I believe it was Ramstein. I think I'm pronouncing that correctly. That, that did the grocery list song. Not Ramstein. Uh, Ram, Ramstein. Yeah. Oh my uh, God. They, the grocery list song. You got it, man. They, they, I hear they put on one live show, man. Oh uh, yeah. I've One seen live their, show. Uh, videos um, of their live show videos, and um, yeah, I, yeah, <laughs> I would. Jim, I'm going to I would definitely, you I would definitely <laughs> get that. <hold up. laughs> um, other than that, man, I mean, the music. I just love the music. If you like, I mean, like, I'll do all kinds. There's a band on there called Electric Mob. They're a really good one. They're, they're not. Uh, they're not real heavy. It's something you can listen to on the radio. Um, guy's got a really, really, really good voice. Um, so, I mean, it's, it's bands like that. Now, I, one of my favorite thrash metal bands that I've the last couple of years has been that uh, Angelus Apatrida. They're from Spain. Man, mm. you know, that's they sound like you know, they got that old Pantera school kind of stuff. Pantera. Yeah, Pantera is my favorite. Metallica, unfortunately, unfortunately, the two guys that are the main Pantera, even though they're torn with Zach Wilde and um. Yeah. Uh, Troy, Troy Benante on drums. Uh, Pantera <laughs> is torn. Jello Jell wants to know how is he not eating that soup? That's six pounds of crab behind him. No, seven pounds actually. Seven right. pounds. Well, my wife is already going. I'm going. I'm just sitting here on the live stream. I'm going to live stream. Once the live stream's over, you know I'm digging in there. <laughs> she's already, she's probably already had her first bowl and going for her second bowl of her soup. No, uh, she she just pulled out. I asked, I said, "What are you doing?" I said, "I'll eat me some soup." <laughs> That's right. That's right. <laughs> make it, make her get down. Okay. Um, yeah, no, I'm going to be eating some, and then we're going to spend the most of the time, and then we'll we'll stick it in our little. We'll freeze it up, and then I usually I usually share maybe one or two one or two bowls of it um, with special you know you friends. Hit up Tim. You know you got to hit up Tim in there. I, oh, yeah. Now that the, now that I finally got that troll litter fixed. Tim, Tim Justin, probably want some soup. Justin, you just missed 
the most delectable looking cooking ever. Yes. Yeah, let's let's grab meat. Well, here, I'll just. You'll, you'll have to you'll have to go back and watch the live stream. It was so delectable looking that I literally could not talk, and you know that's hard for me not to do. He literally, he literally was quiet the whole stream. The whole stream. Yes. <laughs> that's not like yes. Kevin. I no. about, about about hollered at uh, his wife and go, uh, "Can you put a thermometer in him and see if he <laughs> see if he can't run <laughs> <laughs> but that's it, man. I, the, uh, you know, maybe I'll have you guys. Maybe I'll have a live stream and we'll talk. And what, do you, what do you guys when you guys do a live stream? Other than the, the cooked stuff, what do you guys usually talk about? If fishing. I see because fishing, fishing and food, basically what it ends up being. So I mean, you you pretty food, much do yep. more bass. <laughs> you do more um, the bass fishing, right? Smallmouth. Uh, nah. I do. Yes, I do smallmouth he things does. in creek wise. Yep. I'm cat fisherman by, tr by by most standards, but I catch a little bit of everything. So I think uh, I bought this um this thing from a boat. It's called a spider lock, and almost looks like a crappy rig. Um, yeah. But, oh, yeah. but it's it's going to be for cat it's going to be for catfish, and um mm -hmm. it's pretty strong. I just need to make sure because like I said, I can show you a picture. Of my we have a river down here. Um, the blue cats in Maryland are just wreaking just wreaking havoc they are everywhere i got a video i have a I'm gonna turn cold. that that actually might happen sean you never know i might have to take a trip up to uh aberdeen maryland and then just make a uh, side trip over to sam's house for some crab meat crab food just just go meet your uh just me you and your brother me and your yep. brother go and we'll sit up on a susquehanna and we'll go catfishing mm -hmm. and i'll bring some soup there That's you go way. i'm all for that see you, kevin yeah. bye kevin <laughs> <laughs> just leave the poor yeah, Georgia all, boy all alone. It's all good. Yeah, yeah but, but we you, got. Um, can, you, my, can, you my, make, can you make your uh, long drive all the way up here and then another nineteen-hour drive? No, no, no. I don't think so. Because <laughs> that's, really? that's how long. That's how long it takes from here to Aberdeen. From from my house to Aberdeen, it's a nineteen-hour drive. Good, but great. I could, I I could pond. I mean, not pond hop. I could uh, shuttle hop. Across the oh, state, I'll fly. So I ain't driving. Much I ain't driving it's... nineteen hours. I'll fly. <laughs> what I'm saying, yeah, I can that's... shuttle hop across uh, across the nation for about as much as it cost me in gas to get up there. Oh yeah, yeah. The um, because it takes me to get up where Timmy is about an hour forty five for me. Yeah. Um, it's about an hour forty five minute drive. Um, I was just talking to um, a couple guys. They said that the um the the perch and everything are up at the Susquehanna River. Um, the perch are running right now. And once mm -hmm. the perch start running, the catfish start coming in, and they start doing oh, yeah. the uh, catfish. So the river down by me, I want to put that spider lock to the test because I didn't want anything permanent on my boat because I'm more of a bass fisherman for mm -hmm. the back of the boat. So I have yeah. a spider lock that it's a plate that goes in there and you screw this stuff in. And the last, the cat, my biggest catfish down there was 41 pounds, blue cat. That's good cat. So he's got yeah, they got some bigger than cats. you, Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> All right. Well, I'll tell you what well, I'm going to do. Let's, I think let's, 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 let's get rid of the person that doesn't have a 40 plus pound blue cat in, 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 on the live stream. Oh, you don't have a 41 pound blue cat? He, no, he doesn't. What's your, what, what, what's your flathead? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't, I've never caught a flathead. They we got more. The flat, no, the flathead. No, they got flatheads up around the Susquehanna. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, I, that's I know right. they're a big issue, but we got more channel cats and blue cats. And the blue cats are really, I mean, they're, they're like, they're in schools. I got a, a video on my depth finder. That's why they call them they're, a nuisance up there. Yeah, they're, they're a, it's like six foot high and about two, three hundred yards of just stacked blue cats on this river. Mm. That's it's, crazy. It's, I mean, it's. Net them up and send them out my way. I'll throw them in my river. I mean, I'll throw them in my lake. That way I can grow them and catch them. <laughs> they're good eating they're good eating i actually got some, oh, yeah. i actually got some of my freezers um from uh, i love a blue cat so, i'll eat a blue cat over a channel cat any day of the week yeah they're really flat good it's better they're, well i heard well, that but flat i've never eaten flat flat has been uh, flat has always been better all right well uh, tell you guys i think i'm gonna go and i think i'm gonna eat me some soup and i appreciate you having me and i hope everybody 
enjoy uh, enjoy the recipe. The recipes, like I said, they're really easy. There ain't a lot of chopping. There isn't like I would say a, a, a crap load of ingredients. Um, it's very similar, a, a simple. Um, so if you watch this live stream, I only did two changes, and that's basically just using half and half instead of milk and cream and um, the wandra. The wandra worked perfect. You can't taste it. I don't have to cook the flour taste out, and I definitely thank Russ from uh, Smoky Ribs Barbecue. If you like barbecue, man, you got to go check his out. He, he's about he's he's in his 60s. He's been doing it about 10 years. YouTube, mm-hmm. and uh, he's got some he's got some good stuff on there, man. He loves doing it right this time of year. I think he's probably doing it. He does a crawfish boil thing. We're doing a crawfish from Louisiana, doing a crawfish boil and all that stuff. Mm-hmm. I can't Sounds wait. Good. I'm, I'm going to say we just had Creo from uh, Creo Catfish and Jeremy DeFore do a, um, a shrimp and a red gravy. Mm. That sounds pretty damn good, too. Oh, it was. Yeah, it was. Looking good, had, that is. I hadn't had, had it yet. Uh, <laughs> we had uh, Outdoor Wicked Adventures. They did a paddlefish cooking for us. So they cooked up some paddlefish. I mean, needless to say, let's just say that my taste buds have been on fire and I haven't tasted a single thing nobody's had. <laughs> I, I won't lie to you. You're missing out. Both of them are good. Now, more, I'm more of a cream guy. I, I love the cream of soup way better than the vegetable crab. But I'm telling you, you know, you get a you little chilly morning. You know, like you're, you're going out duck hunting or you're out on the water fishing for, you know, real early fishing. And you take a nice big canister of that. Yeah, yeah. that'll keep you warm. I'll tell you what, because that's, yeah, that, that's the best one I've tried. You know, I mean, I've tried some crabs. Here. I'm like, yeah, it's okay. And I'll usually get the cream crab. But yeah. This recipe we tweaked it. Now it's not tradi- I guess traditional. You know, we we kind of tweaked it here and there, but trust me, but that's it's, the it's, eight. it's it's your recipe that works for you. Exactly. Damn right. That's that's what matters. Exactly. Yeah. Well, you go get you a big old bowl, and we appreciate you being on, brother. Yeah, and it no did problem, look absolutely delicious. Yeah, it, I it think really it. did. I appreciate sure. it, and th- thanks for the time. I appreciate you bringing me oh, on. No man. problem, man. Appreciate yeah, you coming sir. up and uh, showing us. Uh, Two different kinds of uh, crab soup. There you yeah. go. Awesome. All right, Kelly. I'll see All you guys right. later, man. All right, buddy. You have a good one. Woo! Take that big old head off there. There we go. <laughs> My gut was over here just a rumbling. Oh, and yeah. I ate before I got on the show. I did too. <laughs> man, that's making me hungry. You ain't lying. I could, I could so, just so do you want to give us a little hint what's coming on Thursday? So, yeah. So, Thursday, I've got a little premiere going on. Um, I, uh, I actually found this footage. Um, it was some footage that had been put back from about six months or so ago, I guess it was. Mm-hmm. And I had actually forgot I had. And it was of, uh, just to give a synopsis there, it was me and Amy Jo uh, was out fishing and... All of a sudden, Amy Joe catches a, a bigger fish than I did and starts stalking smack. <clears throat> so it turned into a competition. Yeah. I'm so, not going to. Um, so she, so she not, caught a bigger fish than you did. She caught a bigger fish and than you I did. And you bust my butt about. Oh, you got to watch the premiere and just see what happened. Oh, I will. I will. Yeah, so, I'll be there. Anyhow, so yeah, the day, the day wore on. I think we wound up catching something like eight. Eight or nine good cats, but I don't. I didn't display all of them because my camera decided it didn't want to act right for right at the beginning. So I didn't. Get, I didn't get all. The, I didn't get all the footage, yeah. but the, I got the most important footage. <laughs> 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 so yeah, it's gonna be. Uh, it's a one v one with uh, KB against Amy Joe, and uh, it's, it's about nineteen Go, minutes. Amy worth of... Go Amy Joe. Kick kids butt. Kick kids butt. <laughs> It's about a it's about a nineteen minute about a nineteen minute uh, uh, film, but it's well yeah. worth it um, uh, to to watch us uh, as we as we pull in some nice cats. So that's at seven fifteen. We're going to be doing a premiere, so you guys uh, tune in for that. And, um, and I'll probably be fishing right before that. You'll be wow. fishing right before that. Yes. Sounds good. Don't know where I'm going to be at, but I'll be I'll be somewhere. Ten for that. So. I don't know what else I got going on after that. Um, I don't think. Do we have anybody? Yeah, we've got somebody lined up for next week, don't we? I don't. You know. 
Wow. Well, I got I got I got to message him because I did tell him about um, about the arrangement that we had. Maybe a different day. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. He was. He said it was okay. He did message me uh, back that he would like to. He was all for it. So I need to message him and see if he's all for that date that I mentioned. Let me do that right now. Somewhere is a good place to be. Yes, I know. I just don't know where to, where I'm going to be at, Becca. I just don't know because I just I'm wondering where to go. That's I know that I can put on a fishing show. That, that's the thing. So, the, you know the little pond that I go to, the one I just yep. went to the other day. Yeah. So I did find out, and I need to do an experiment. So before we actually do this live, but um, I did find out that I have some decent signal out there with my phone. Right, there you go. So I'm actually thinking about doing a, um, instead of setting up the tripod, I don't know. I may set up the tripod just in, I, I hate having to lug that thing. Cause I have to go all the way around this pond to fish it sometimes. But, um, I may actually set that lot or that uh, tripod up so that, um, uh, so that I can do a little, little live fishing whenever I'm out there catching bass. So, so I did find that he, out. Let me see if he gets the message and he he texts back, and we might be able to confirm it. Hey. What's up, Dale Hayslip? Dale, what's up, buddy? Miss Becca, I just want to let you know, darling, and and just please forgive me. I mean, I've always seen your little pretty face there on your little thumbnail, but I finally got to see your smiling, animated face on um, the 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 what was it? Roger women's Mintz, call out tournament. Yeah, that one. Yeah. And I just wanted to say, you're so pretty. <laughs> <laughs> I told, I told, uh, I, I told Kelly today. I said I finally got to see Becca's face for a change. That every time I see her on a live stream, she's she's hiding behind her her uh, logo. <laughs> hey, trust me, it, it, it's it's probably it's probably one of the better faces that you've seen of her because. There's some faces that she's wore before, and it's like uh, <laughs> kind of scary. <laughs> Just kidding, Miss Becca. Unless it's one of those masks. <laughs> so, so you said you missed Miss already? Becca's awesome. She's she's always been awesome, uh, especially to I the like community that. and everything. It's she's always been a big supporter of everybody's. Definitely. Oh yeah, no doubt, no doubt. But uh, see that she's all right. There, well, where, where she's at right there. <laughs> yeah, this this is what I was talking about. I did wear the beard once. <laughs> she did wear a beard once. Yes, she did. <laughs> she really did. And the and the and the thing is, is it matched her hair. <laughs> it wow. was blonde, just like her hair. Well, I, I'm I'm gonna have to say this because Becca's got one of those voices that you know it's it's very unique, very it, it's 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 a voice that it's it's not an unpleasant voice by no means, but it's one of those voices that you know that resonates in your mind and to such an extent that when she said, "Well, thank you, appreciate that very much," that was sweet of you to say. I literally heard her say it, yeah, in her voice. That's that's awesome. Ah, uh, no problem, buddy. No problem. I'm glad you. Hey, congratulations on the 1K, and yep. um, you guys have really been putting in the work and doing uh, and, and doing the 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 job that that it takes to to get there. Unfortunately, oh, yeah. I can't do it. <laughs> so, I mean, I'm proud of I'm proud of both of you guys getting where you, you know get your goals. And um, the kissing fish, um, I think that seems to be going pretty good. Uh, your kitchen and fish uh, lures and in and, and um, yeah. uh, what is it your your uh, your leaders and such as that that you guys sell um, well, seems to be taking off. I've been kind of following both of you ever since. Uh, ever since we had you on the show, I've been kind of following you on Facebook and, and of course, obviously YouTube and and uh, just to see you know where you're going. And it seems like you guys are going in the right direction. So you guys keep it up. Very proud of both of you. Absolutely. So. I agree, Dale. Becca is a very beautiful young lady. Well, Bubba, I know that usually this is our time frame, but I uh, I had to set aside some things so we could come in early that I need to get on. So no problem. Yeah, if you need to cut um, up, cut up, man. 
yep i need to do that so we want to go ahead and end this thing out tonight and uh so we'll see y'all we'll make an announcement uh we may or may not based on what we hear back or what kelly hears back from this particular guest be on another night and if it is we will definitely highlight that and advertise that pretty strong yep. Yep. I heard, um, hopefully i'll hear back because he's at work right now so so uh you guys just kind of be watching out on our on our social medias uh facebook uh the the community pages on both of our channels um a lot of times we post out there what we're going to be doing next and yep. um so if there is a little bit of a change that will uh that will definitely be highlighted oh absolutely Absolutely. All right, well, I do appreciate everybody coming in here and hitting that thumbs up and sharing out. If you didn't hook them up, uh, Outdoors in Maryland and them, uh, make sure you do. Uh, they're an awesome, awesome channel. Um, and you put their link good, in the Sam's description. Sam's a good guy. Right? He really is. You put their link in the description, right? Uh, no, but I can, but I am posting. I, we've been posting it in the chat. So, yeah. Go ahead and, I probably wouldn't hurt to go ahead and drop it in the, um, in the description. I will. Later. I will after as soon as we're done. Yep. Temple. All right, guys. Y'all have a great night. Appreciate y'all coming in and being yep. with us tonight. Hope you yep. uh hope your bellies were grumbling just as bad as mine was and your lips were salivating just as bad as mine was. <laughs> yep, and your tongues were beating your brains out. Exactly. On that note, y'all have a great night. We will see you on the next one. All right. See you all. <laughs>